Yo, how's it going, my amigos and my amigas? Welcome back to a brand new video. It is I, the CEO of Bowling, the CEO of The Funny. <laughs> I'm sorry, but if you actually have comedy in your handle via Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, chances are you're not funny. And that's just a sad reality. Now, am I saying that I am the funniest person on YouTube or anything? No, I am not the funniest person on YouTube. The reason why I'm telling you this is because I found this guy on TikTok, and this has to be one of the most sensitive people I've seeing in a few months i mean we already made a video called the most sensitive girl ever it's 2022 it's equality time and now it's time i clown on biggest bitches biggest crybabies i've seen in a hot minute so for context this man posted this video to tiktok then he got backlash then he got hate comments and mean comments that make me cry bro and he decided to respond to it in the worst way possible this is how you don't respond to any criticism ever so for context i'm going to show you the clip that he originally uploaded like all mumble rap is like I, I took a Xanax And another Xanax I did some Molly And I took another Xanax Sweet bars bro The reason why I played that <laughs> Okay that was really cringe <laughs> Like if it doesn't have bars it's trash Okay, so listen here. I love bars, but I also like mumble rap. And I could like both of them. I could go from Playboy Cardi to Eminem. I could go back and forth, right? I'm not a guy who says, if this song doesn't have any bars, it's absolute trash. What do you mean you don't have bars in your song? Playboy Cardi is one of my favorite artists. So when I see posts like these, it really makes Eminem fans look really bad. <laughs> Like, it's just so horrible. Sweet bars, bro. Where's the lyrical, spiritual, lyrical, lemonade, lemonade? Like, it doesn't always have to have a message, bro. Sometimes I just want to jump on the house, jump on the house. Like, come on. It received 2.4 thousand likes and 2,000 comments. So a lot of hate, a lot of criticism. Rightfully so, your video sucks. You're not funny. This video isn't funny. I don't know who told you you were funny. If you have comedy in your handle, chances are you're not funny. That's like telling everyone, hey, guys, I'm funny. I'm so likable. I'm so humble. I'm so nice. Chances are you're none of those. So here we responded with this video and it is horrible if you thought the first one was bad this one's worse and let me just say if you use tiktok you are definitely either a nonce a loser or a moron aren't you on tiktok sick comebacks bro you're like a 30 year old man on tiktok you so you really called yourself out and exposed yourself as a pedophile <laughs> as an idiot as an <laughs> and as a moron and let me just say if you use tiktok you are definitely either a nonce a loser or a moron and if you can't work out which of the three you are you are definitely at least a fucking moron and I'm telling you right here, you are a fucking retard. This guy is crying and bitching about hate comments in 2021, almost 2022. Now, I don't know how big this guy is. I don't know if he has millions of followers. I doubt it. Like, just take my example. There's like Reddit posts and threads and, you know, tweets and videos of people who don't like me and mean comments. And do I let him affect me? No. Why? Because I actually have a life because I live outside of the internet. The hate, quote unquote hate. And it's very little. It's like... I don't care. Just to prove to this man that I actually like music with bars, with nothing but bars. A Logic song goes something like, tell me what you think of me, I swear it doesn't matter, just as long as I am happy and my pocket's getting fatter. Sweet bars, bro. That's what I do. <laughs> and I don't delete comments, I, I, you know, it's freedom. It's freedom of speech, say whatever the fuck you want about me. Whether you think I'm funny, whether you think I'm annoying and obnoxious and loud or not funny and cringe, like, I'm never going to silence the critics. I'm never going to strike videos. I do not fuck with that behavior. But this man right here should not be on the internet because he clearly cannot take an ounce of criticism whatsoever he gets a few mean comments and he's bitching and crying about it like bro your video was cringe you deserve to be called out you are you are definitely at least a fucking moron now what i've done there is set up a little trap to prove that no one on tiktok can take a fucking joke if you oh dang it oh, i fell for the trap i fell for the trap i'm a I'm a fucking moron. <laughs> I'm gonna go tell my mom right now that this guy who looks like smells like sweaty balls and cheese just called me a fucking loser. Yeah, you got me there. Now what I've done there is set up a little trap to prove that no one on TikTok can take a fucking joke. If you want to see how fucking miserable everyone on that shit site is, go over to TikTok or if you're on it now, just scroll down and have a little look at the comments below. Of white? <laughs> so they call this guy white and he's crying. Look 
at all these comments. This took time to look for. If you're crying over this, you're a little bitch. And the internet is not for you. You're honestly just a little bitch. I is. Go over to TikTok, or if you're on it now, just scroll down and have a little look at the comments below of everyone being fucking furious. Uh, he's not a comedian. He's not funny. I'm some fucking hell. You're not funny. I know you're trying to play it cool, like your feelings are not hurt, but dude, you're not funny at all. And that's coming from me, so. <laughs> <laughs> when someone like me tells you you're not funny, you know you fucked up. Here's a tip for you. Why don't you go out and get some bitches instead of making these horrible TikToks? You need to chill the fuck out and stop reading the comments. Median, it's not funny. I'm some fucking hurt. Oh, I wasted 15 seconds of my life looking at that. Ah! And just so you know, I don't have TikTok on my phone. I'll never read a single one of your comments. So go wild. Call me anything you want in the comments. Have at it. Then how do you manage to get all of those other comments? What do you mean you don't have TikTok on your phone. You're a TikToker. Oh, guys, I don't have YouTube on my phone. Uh, leave whatever you want. Then tell me, how did you collect all of these comments? Do you have an editor for TikTok? And if you do, you're a fucking moron. And I guarantee you, you're the type of person who says, I don't read the comments. And you read every single one of them until you cry. I'm so fucking hurt. Oh, I wasted 15 seconds of my life looking at that. Ah! And just so you know, I don't have TikTok on my phone. I'll never read a single one of your comments. So go wild. Call me anything you want in the comments. Have at it. Enjoy yourself. It'll be the first time in your fucking life, you miserable TikTok shit. Why is he so aggressive? I thought you didn't care, bro. <laughs> yeah, I don't care what people say, but I do care. So you listen to me, you little shit. You call me out one more time. You make fun of me wearing glasses and I'll come for you. But I don't care. I don't care, but I do care, but I don't care. Here, I'm gonna read the comments, fuck it. You definitely cried yourself to sleep after this video. I could never imagine myself recording something this fucking stupid and editing it and uploading it to TikTok to prove to my haters that I don't care. Please quit the internet or become funnier.